A scientist from the East Midlands has been describing the amazing experience of being part of the NASA team, which is working on the mission to explore Mars. Dr John Bridges says there is clear evidence that was one, there was once water on the Red Planet. The Curiosity rover project may even go on to discover if there was ever life on Mars. Well, next month, Dr Bridges, who's from the University of Leicester, will be speaking at the BBC's Stargazing Live event. Tickets go on sale this Friday. More details, here's Simon Ward. This was how NASA imagined the mission to Mars would look. Despite everything that could have gone wrong, it's been an amazing success. And now the Curiosity rover is exploring the planet and sending back pictures and data. Dr John Bridges was in California as part of the science team. It was a fantastic experience. Uh, it was exciting and it was nerve-wracking during the entry, descent and landing. And we've been finding um, a lot of new stuff which is scientifically uh, important and it's going to keep us busy for a long time to come. Dr. Bridges uses a scanning electron microscope to study meteorites. They've already found firm evidence for ancient rivers on Mars. But what about the big question? What about life on the planet? One of the things that we're particularly interested in with Mars Science Laboratory is to determine if Mars was ever what we say is called habitable for microbial life. So to answer that question, we have to find out things like the temperature of water, how long there was water there, um, the composition of the fluids, acid or alkaline, sort of basic things like that that we have to uh, work out and after that we'll be in a better position to determine if there could ever have been life on Mars. Dr Bridges continues to study the data being sent back from Mars and he'll also return to NASA in America. It's possible that the Mars rover could keep exploring the planet for years. Simon Ward, BBC East Midlands Today, Leicester.